Hi guys, welcome back to 17 square meters garden. In today's video, I want to show you how I'm decorating my balcony garden for fall. So as you know, I garden all year round, so there's plenty of plants that will remain um, green and or will be flowering during fall and during winter. Um, there's a lot of evergreen plants, a lot of perennial plants, so I'm not going to decorate like the entire balcony, but I always pick up like one area or two where I add a little bit, you know, of fall color, fall decorations um, to make it look a little bit more seasonal. So that's the area that I want to decorate for fall. Usually I decorate this corner because it kind of fits. I don't know, just I just feel like this corner looks very nice uh, when you put some plants and you make some little display. So there are still some plants that will be gone, like for example here, cotton flower will not survive the winter. There are some coleus that will die with the first frost. Um, but yeah, I already started to prepare. As you can see, I have some empty pots just, you know, laid out to kind of give me an idea of how I want the things to look like. But before we start decorating the corner, I want to plant up this cute wicker basket with some fall composition. I really like wicker baskets. I have one, I will show you in a minute. In a minute. I have one planted with begonia. Um, so in this one, I want to make some cute fall composition and I will show you how I'm doing this. Here are the plants that I am going to use today. I have some heater. Um, some ornamental cabbage, some Dusty Miller. If you saw my video of um, getting ready for fall, um, I was propagating them. They didn't grow much because, I mean, it's fall, so plants don't grow that vigorously, but they will be still cute little accent. Um, here we have one pansy. I'm not sure if I will be able to fit it in. And some trailing plant, Mullenbeckia, I believe that's how you pronounce it. Here it is. So first I spray the basket with the wood preservative. I then line it with plastic bag and poke drainage holes at the bottom with a knife. Putting some soil at the bottom and planting all the plants. So that's how it looks finished. What do you guys think? You like it? I kind of like it, I think. There's uh, quite a lot going on, but that's okay because in fall plants don't grow very much. So they will be perfectly fine, packed so tightly. Last year I used typical fall colors here, using a lot of orange and green. But this year I wanted something completely different, so I'm choosing some shades of pink or burgundy mixed with some silver and blue. I didn't buy very many plants for that purpose, only some chrysanthemums and pansies. The rest of the plants I already had on my balcony. So now I will add some little accents like pumpkins. I bought orange pumpkins, but since they don't fit with the color them, I'm painting them white. These are of course artificial pumpkins. So that's how it all looks planted up. I actually spent a lot of time rearranging the pots because I wasn't sure how I want them to be placed and I kept moving them around until I finally found a good layout. I also had this empty house lantern and I added a few decorations inside to make it look more festive. So I hope that you enjoyed this little video today, maybe it gave you some new ideas for your balcony garden. Thank you so much for joining me and I'll see you in my next video.